Welcome back, everybody, to Beer Factory. I am RP Gaming, and I am so glad you can join me. We are taking a second look at this. Uh, you guys have shown some interest in this, so we might be doing a playthrough of this. This is uh, this is great to hear. I'm actually very interested in playing this game, and uh, thank you guys so much for uh, giving me uh, uh, the heads up to go ahead and do it. So, first off, you guys know how I feel about key binding and how I like to be able to have that option in the game. So, I was looking around in here. My mouse was was a very uh, active mouse so in controls I had to go down here and tone it down I usually have to cut it in half for most games and then uh, I noticed you actually can keybind in the game, but it's a little bit a little bit tricky. And here's what I mean by that. So now you can see I have my interaction set to E, and I am thrilled for that. And if you guys are fans of E instead of F, this is how you have to do it. Before E will become available, you need to go through this menu. You have to find every E key. Let me be clear. All of the default E's have to be switched to F. And then you can assign all of the F's to E. So the move up forks was once E, it's now F. Uh, switch engine was F, it's now E. If you understand where I'm going here, you have to swap out the F's for the E's. And then you can get everything lined up the way it's supposed to be. But you do have to replace every single E with an F first. If that makes sense. So anyway, I found that out. I thought I'd pass that along to you. So where we are, we are uh, at level three now. I went ahead and I cleaned up the station, or the station, I'm sorry. I cleaned up the beer factory here and got us uh, up to the level three to move along. So we need to buy a slot for pallets and we need to equip our... Uh, our toolbox in order to do that so let's go ahead and do that and then we have to go into tab and we're gonna buy one of these so I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna place this right here and I get to use E now to place which is awesome okay so now we need to uh, connect a workstation uh, with a uh, pallet slot so let's get off of this and we're gonna open up our tab and now over here let's see now I think we have to I think we have to hit this, yeah, new link E, and then we have to link this to one of these. Now it might be, might be we have to link it to this. Let's go ahead. Yeah, we do. All right, so we'll validate this. All right, now we need to hire a new worker. So this is how I plan on the doing the playthrough, guys, is I want to see how the game's performing. It is uh, in a full release. And by the way, you can use either one of these computers. You don't have to use uh, that one. Uh, you got to close the tab so that you're back into your, uh, into your interaction. And then let's go ahead and um, what did they want us to do? Hire a new worker. All right, so let's go over here to employees and let's hire this guy and interact with him. I hope everybody's doing well. Thank you so much for uh, joining me. I uh, do appreciate the uh, time that you guys give me, and uh, I will try not to steal too much. We'll probably go for about 20, 25 minutes again and see what happens. All right, pal, can you stand still? All right, so objective, level up the employee. All right, so we'll do that. I'm just going to do everything it tells us to do. Assign him uh, to the grain crusher. All right, so let's go ahead and assign him. And again, you need to drink coffee if you want to sprint around in this game, uh, everybody. So remember that. And we have to keep an eye on that icon right up there on the top left where the flashlight and the coffee cup is. We've got to make sure that stays white. I somehow ended up with an extra bag of crushed malt. And I don't know what to do with it right now, so I'm just going to leave it right there. All right, we need to finish the construction and unlock the brewery in the underground. All right, so this, we got to go over to the computer, I think, to look at. Let's take a look. Construction company, and it looks like we need to earn some money to be able to buy this upgrade. All right, so that's going to mean we're going to have to get to work here. So let's, uh, we have an employee now, so let's get, uh, uh, let's get a contract here. All right, this one looks easy. What do we got? Uh, refined sacks of raw malt. All right, we're going to go ahead and accept that. Let's call for a delivery. This is the raw malt. How much did they want? 17. Let's go ahead and get that. Yeah, I, I, I really like this. Uh, it's very, very, uh, very interesting. Uh, the graphics are pretty cool. Uh, everything's playing pretty nicely. So now we have to finish the construction. Okay, but that, that's based on us making the money. So let's see if we can make a little money here. 
Here comes the uh, load. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, yep, I'm going to go ahead and take a look at the load here. I'll open up the door. How many do we have here? We only have one pallet. That's good. All right, let's go ahead and get on our vehicle. I'm going to go ahead and uh, use my uh, my Xbox controller. Now I had I watched uh, Brito. He, you can go up to the side. I guess there's a kind of an auto load feature here. Let me see if I can do it. First of all, I got to get used to this again, folks. Just give me a second. Get the coordination down here for driving the forklift. So it's better to turn and then go. There you go. All right, so I'm going to lower this a little bit. I'm going to move up here. And now right here, lock. All right, well, that was a little wonky. <laughs> All right, we got it, though. We got it. Let me lower this. Go forward. And we'll bring this over to this guy. Yep, we're all set. Lower this. Yeah, this, this is the only way I can do this. I have to be in this uh, first person. And I'm still, you know, still getting my coordination on how to do this. Oh, I've got a pallet jack over there. Hold on, everybody. Let me shut this off. Let me get off my forklift. Let me get rid of this pallet jack. All right. I'm going to turn myself around here. And go drive it this way. Seems to be a little bit easier if you kind of throw the camera around. This thing's very slow, though. Very slow. Okay, let's, that's all we need. Get back on here. And uh, back into my... Get back into my view, and let me start my engine. All right, here we go. We drop this down for this guy, right here. All right, down, and then back out. There we go. I should be up. Oh, 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 come on. There we go. There we go. Yeah, there. All right. Awesome. We turn this around. Probably going to need to have it facing this way, and we'll shut her down. We'll get out. Yeah, probably going to have to go keep it this way let me get this out of the way now so it's not in our way as we go forward here oops that's wrong there we go there we go i'm driving it backwards so it's uh, a little bit weird all right so let me get this out of the way and we'll uh we'll continue on here all right i want to get this uh over here real quick and we're going to start this up and start collecting our uh our product here as he's loading it so let me grab this real quick All right one just fell so they will do that and another one just fell so up at the top here sometimes they get hung up uh, so you got to watch out for that it, it looks like we got a couple of them that fell let me let me try to process as much as we have here yeah, so we're just, you know, we're going to do everything that the objectives tell, and we're going to just see how this works. I mean, unfortunately, it doesn't look like it's auto palleting right now. It looks like it's just kind of going wherever it wants. Uh, but, yeah, this is what's happening. So we'll just deal with it as it goes. All right, that's, that's done. All right, it actually... Okay, so here's... Look at that. All right, so we just exploded everything just by touching it. And I'm going to grab the pallet. This is raw. Uh, this is raw. I'm trying to grab the pallet, but I just keep gra grabbing raw uh, material here forever. Let me grab the pallet. So you see what's going on here? I've highlighted the uh, the pallet, and uh, it won't let me. Let me try R. Solve object location and rotation. All right. Maybe we'll try this. Let's see. This is raw malt. So he failed. Because if you load this, this is crushed malt. If you load this too quickly, this conveyor belt, if you don't stagger these up at the top there, let me, if I can get a camera angle going here to kind of show you guys what I notice is right in that area where my dot is pointing. You see how it just dropped through? If you don't stagger that, they'll kind of bunch up there and this will be the result right here. So let's get this fixed. Uh, you know, he failed. <laughs> You know, that's, that's the only thing I could say, right? Is he did not perform as uh, as uh, as we wanted. Now, this is the crushed malt. Crushed malt, this is the finished. I'm trying to figure out. And it's very... Now, I just kicked that again. Where'd it go? We just lost the pallet. We literally just lost the pallet. Okay, so that... That is... 
That's unacceptable. <laughs> that is unacceptable. All right, folks, I reset it uh, from the save, and we'll see if we can uh, do this again without that, uh, you know, it bugged out. This is all I can think of doing. You know, this is this is how we're going to test the game out, the only way we're going to be able to do it. Look at it. See, he speeds that up. All right, and are they getting caught up there? See, I'm watching that. Keep an eye. See how they're see how they're going in like that. Got to make sure. All right, I don't see anything now. Let's go ahead and try this again. See if I can get the pallet a little bit uh, better located uh, to accept the load here. Let's try that right there. All right, I'm going to stand back as far as I can so we can see what's going on. Uh, I did increase my uh, my. Uh, vision on the game from 90 to 100 just to get a little bit of a wider view so we can see this now see that that's not good that one that just again it's doing it again we've got some raw ones they're not auto loading so yeah this is uh yeah this is not good this should be auto loading on the pallet it's not we've got missed uh processed materials gathering on the ground here with crushed malt and i'm just gonna let it go through its thing and if we can't get this working in this playthrough then i will probably not play this game uh that's raw malt this is crushed malt see i don't know what's going on here what is it uh crushed malt exported this is what we need that's raw malt that it actually gathered so that's the problem so let me drop this so here's what happened. Here's where the game glitched. And I want I'm going to leave this in because because you need to see what's going on with the game in its current state. So two raw made it out of there and landed on the pallet which they don't mix. So that caused this backup. So what I'm going to try to do is see if I can fix this. And I know if I even touch this pallet it's just going to explode. See? Look. Already. So what's going on here? Why is that doing that? Let me get this off. And all right, now look, see what's going on here? Now we can go ahead and load these. Let's see if we can salvage this. Uh, hopefully we can. But uh, you know, this is the playthrough, guys. This is how it uh, this is how it goes sometimes. We had big, big bug happen, and the only way that I could recover was just to, you know, load from the save. And I would suggest in this in this state, uh, you know, where it's claiming to be full, fully released, uh, I'd say this is a early access that's released under the fully uh, banner. And uh, I hope they I hope they fix it because this could be a really good game. Is this the crushed? This is crushed. I need the crushed. Okay, I gotta. I'm you know trying to distinguish between what is finished product and what is product that we still have to uh, process. All right, I am recovering. Let me get over here. I don't want to touch this pallet because it will blow up. This is raw malt. Let me see what happens if I put this in here. I'll send it up there, buddy. You just stand there and uh, just have a little break. Go have a coffee. While we, uh, while we explore this. Okay, so this is a crushed malt that will go here. All right, I'm going to go ahead and try to get the rest of this. I do not want to touch this. Let's go ahead and see if I can get the other ones to come out and see if we can fulfill the uh, contract. We got three times four here. So we got 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Okay, we do have a complete, uh, a complete load. All right, let's go ahead and pick it up. All right. Wow. That was, uh, that was something, man. I really want this game to work. Uh, and I hope they get this, uh, get this fixed. I, I, I haven't, I've only seen, um, Brito play it. I haven't looked at other, uh, videos yet on this to see, uh, how other folks are getting along with this game. Uh, so yeah, this is how it's acting for RP gaming folks. The average guy playthrough. Are we going to be able to, uh, drop a dime on this and Will it do what it's supposed to do for us? And can we come home at the end of a hard day's work and enjoy our own little brew factory here? Okay, let me come up a little bit. Let me back up, come up a little bit. Let me get this. I can see what's going on here. All right, great. Now I'm going to go ahead and use the auto lock feature. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and pop this in a truck. See if we can make some money because we've got to finish the construction and unlock the brewery in the underground here. All right, I'm just gonna turn it around here, folks. Just bear with me. 
Alright, raise up my forks. So you do have to clear the bed, and then it will auto-load right there. Okay, good. Bring my forks down. There we go. I probably should keep this out here because we're probably going to have to make another sale, earn a little bit more money. Let's go ahead and we'll shut off our forklift because we're pro I don't know if we're actually using propane uh, in the game. You know, if that's a thing. Right now, I'm just kind of concentrating on the objectives and seeing if we can, uh, you know, get uh, through this. You know, try to try to get a 25-minute look at this on the uh, second playthrough. And thank you guys again for, uh, for joining me. I do appreciate it. Uh, and don't forget to uh, like the video and drop comments if you uh, if you're inclined. And you know, let me know: uh, Are you playing this? Uh, what's your experiences with it? Is what I'd like to know. It's got mixed reviews right now on Steam, and I can see why. I can see why this is a very uh, very tedious endeavor at this point. Okay, we have some money. Let's see if we can fulfill. Let's see what the price is to fulfill the objectives first off. So we got to go to upgrades. We've got to go to construction. All right, so it's cost eleven $1 hundred uh, just to upgrade, and we have eleven $1 hundred. I don't think that's a wise move. I think we still need to deal with some contracts and get more money going. So I think that's what we'll do. We'll accept another contract uh, because we won't have the money to fully upgrade. We'll be able to upgrade, and then we'll be stuck. So let's see if we can build up a little bit of a uh, uh, fund here before we try to do that upgrade. And we might not even be able to get the upgrade done uh, in this episode. Let's get the delivery. What do we need? We need 17 again. I like that. Seven, 17's a nice number. Now these are open and we haven't, we got to make sure when we read the contract, we're buying the right. So raw malt. I just want to make sure that's right. Raw malt right here. 17 of them. All right, let's buy that. Yeah, I really want this this game to uh, perform, man, because I really think this is cool. It's a it's a great idea. You know what I wish I could do? Can I buy uh, pallets? Can I buy like an extra pallet? Let me check. Uh, let me see. Forklift. We uh, you know we we haven't looked at this yet. I don't want to look at it right now. I want to stay focused. Just wanted to see if a, there was a place that I could buy a pallet. Uh, maybe in my, uh, if I bring this up, where's my, uh, where's my, oh, we have to reload, by the way, every time you, uh, have to, uh, reload the game, you have to reload your, uh, your tools as well. All right, we got our, our materials here. Let's go ahead and see what we have. Let's open this up. We should only have one pallet. Yep. And let's go ahead and grab this real quick. Controller. And let's back this up. All right, it's at the very end here. We'll go ahead and get in my view. Let's raise up the forks just high enough for the auto load to engage. Let's see if I can maneuver this now. So when you're using the Xbox, you, oh, right there, right there, right there. That's what I want, right there. I want to bring it back a little bit because I don't want it to uh, interact too much with the truck. There we go. Come on. You got it. There you go. Now let me see if I have to close his door. Yep, I might have to close his door, so hold on here. Go ahead and uh, close the door. I'll bring his lift up. And there you go. Door closed. All right, good deal. Let's get in our view. All right, great. You can leave now, buddy. You're all set. Thank you so much. All right, so here, here's the problem. I think if I could get this, if I could get this going faster. So what I want to do before I, before I load this down here, let's take a look real quick. Let me lower my forks a little bit here. I want to jump off this real quick because I think the key to this is going to be if we can grab another, a second pallet. Let's open this up. What are we allowed to buy? Are there pallets? All right. So I don't see any pallets. I see pallet slots and deck. You know, well, we can buy decorative stuff, but yeah, gameplay. All right. So, you know, what my, my theory was, what I was hoping is I'm going to be dropping this off. He's going to start loading. And if I could start processing as fast as he was loading, maybe it would be uh, a little more successful. Uh, but we'll see. We'll give this another go. And yeah, I think we're gonna. I'm gonna have to earn some money here in order to uh, pull this off, guys. So we we might have to just see how this one goes. And can I leave this now? There. Yep. All right. So that's good right there. Go ahead and get off the forklift. Let's get over here real quick. All right, so what I want to see, I just want to make, you know, when he starts dropping them in here, all right, so he's putting them in. 
Now, see, if he maintains that, now that spacing right there, there goes one. Let's see, if I could start doing it right now, maybe I should just do it and let him fall on the floor, uh, then grab the pallet, because it's only 17. Let's do that. Uh, this is my workaround until I get a second pallet, because I know what's going to happen is one of those raw ones will come out and it'll uh, it'll mess things up again. So let's just see if we can let a bunch of bunch of this stuff just fall here on the floor, and I'll just have to hand load it. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get more pallets in the game. I'll be able to uh, unlock that wherever that is in this uh, objective story arc we're uh, locked into here right now. Uh, but yeah. Second pallet is definitely needed. So I'm, this stuff's just going to fall on the floor. It is crushed now, which is what we want. So I'm fine hand lifting it. It's only 17. We'll do that quickly and uh, see if we can get some more money. All right, I think that's all of it. Let's go ahead and grab the pallet. All right, I am already out of energy. Uh, I am already going to need another coffee. So let me go ahead and just kind of put this in a place where I know after I load it, we're going to be able to uh, drop. There we go. Excellent. So let's go ahead and get this stuff loaded up. And uh, I'll get right back with you after I get this stuff loaded up, guys. All right. I've got them all loaded here. And uh, thank you much, guys, for being patient and uh, allowing me to do that. So uh, thank you very much, everybody. And I'm so glad you're joining me on these episodes. And I really, really, I really want this game uh, to work because uh, I love the premise of this, right? I mean, don't we all really want this to work? Because it's, it is it is a really cool uh, idea. Let me stop right here. I'm just going to auto lock. All right, so this is going to give us a little more money as well. So I feel that, you know, what I had to just go through there, guys, I feel if I had a second pallet that we could, we could definitely uh, not have to be bugged like that. Uh, maybe if I had the pallet there uh, again, uh, it might not have bugged out, but you saw what happened. If there's a chance of the raw stuff getting by and it hits the pallet, it definitely takes over. Now, that should have loaded up. Why didn't that load up? It's, there we go. All right, you do have to be a certain height. Not bad. All right, let's go see how much money we made from that. And I'll determine from this payout how much of a grind. And I, Look at this. I need coffee already. Got to keep an eye on that uh, coffee meter, folks. So we're at 940 uh, out of that 1,100 that we had. So we invested. Uh, let's see what our return is uh, because we're going to need money twice in order to uh, complete, complete this. And I don't want to, uh, I don't want to waste you guys' time. So, uh, you know, let's just get to it. All right. So let's validate this. That, that was only 400 bucks, you know, so that's, that's still not enough. That gives us 1,100 uh after the payout and we're then we're going to be down to 319 so we're definitely going to need more contracts we're definitely going to need to grind a little bit uh in order to push this objective narrative through so this is what i'm going to do guys i'm leaving uh the video i'm going to you know it i had to reload the video to correct that bug i'm leaving the bug in i want you guys to see how this game plays and it's honesty because that's what it's all about it's about us it's about do we want to play a game uh, that's going to frustrate us or do we want to play a game that's going to give us uh, a relaxing time and a, and a fun experience so uh, don't forget to hit the like button and if you'd like to support this channel and these playthroughs please consider a subscription and uh, i will see you guys in episode three of this because we are going to come back i'm going to grind off camera get a little funds going do some contracts and then we'll push on from there so thank you very much again for joining me and ta-ta and bye-bye